That's the perks. Right. Mark, anytime you're ready, you ask Keith. Yeah. Just turn down yeah. to us. Okay. Keith, gentlemen, this question about uh, about celebrity. You know, the first time. Do you remember the, the very first time that you noticed people treating you differently because they recognized you? Like little things like upgrading you on an airline or, <laughs> or giving you a better seat in a restaurant. How did how did that take form? Uh, precisely in that manner. Yeah, it's something happened like very that. well. Someone. And it's a, it's a it's a scary thing, meaning it's a quite it's a seductive thing. It's a, it's something you can fall into and start taking as um, as real. But what you're really dealing with is usually people's projections, good and bad. And it's a nice thing, but it's it's a, it's also uh, I think it it's dangerous ground. Yeah, it can be it can be um, sometimes it can feel arbitrary, but sometimes at its nicest it can if depending on the person it can feel very it, it can feel connected. It can feel appreciative, uh, like a true. response to. Yeah. What you've put out in terms of your work and stuff, but you know, actually, we we put a thing in Fight Club um, that's sort of a little bit on that score, which is, you know, when we first meet, he gets up and you know, he gets up and essentially just moves on up into first class, like, and I'm left sort of going, why can't I do that? Which is a lot about what you're talking about. That. Yeah. Okay, question. Well, before we talk about the movie, Such about oh, but we're jobs. You know what it is? Sorry to interrupt. It's I, I think about this one a lot. It's just that you, it's the feeling of being it's the the danger is that you you think of yourself as special that you start becoming special and that's when it can get out of control you start thinking you're a unique snowflake yeah, that's right that's a yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right continue you're not a unique snowflake <laughs> we're all part of the same compost heap okay. okay well a question about weird jobs you know working as a court reporter now how brain did you do that? numbing was that and and did you ever want to like change the record when you were like proofreading the stuff well, I you didn't. Were a court reporter. No, I wasn't a court reporter. Oh, well, you, you proofread I the proofread, record. Um, yeah. I proofread court reporting records. Yeah. Huh. So, so how how uh, brain numbing was that to do? And, and did you ever have fun with that job when you were doing it? Um, it it was brain numbing, but only about as half as brain numbing as press junkets. Those are. <laughs> oh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> well, if we're gonna talk about weird jobs, how about this one. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, a question about the movie. Yeah. The makeup artists on this film. Now, how jazzed were they? Would you like to meet her? She's right. She's right in here. Yeah. Well, the fabulous Jean Black, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> All right. And Julie Pierce. Okay. Well, and Julie well, Pierce. Well, how much fun did they have working with you the guys and, and is creating these these effects? It was great. It was it was more fun for them than us, I think, because we ended up being the ones sitting in the chair for 45 minutes, an hour and a half, while they applied those. Amazing broken noses and broken noses and prosthetic bruises and swollen eyes. It was they did a phenomenal job. Yeah. Well, how amusing for you when you walked away from the set or walked away from the, well, the set and out of makeup and seeing the reactions of people who didn't know what was going on. Yeah, it was um we were we were pretty contained to this tight little zone in around the stage, so we were our own little microcosm. Yeah, it, we, we were kind of in our own little world while we made this film. Yeah. Okay. And the fight scenes themselves. Now, how tense is the atmosphere when you're doing that? Because I know you have to choreograph things pretty, pretty tightly. You have to work together pretty well. Yeah, I'll tell you. When we were in Fight Club, though, I, I, the actors were really getting into it. Which yeah, was pretty fun. It was that was fun to watch. Yeah, right? that sort of screaming energy of the room while you're doing it. It's, it does send your heart rate up a little bit. Pentecostal church. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and one quick last question. This is a great line in the movie when you two are talking about. About well, what celebrity would you like to get into a fight with? I mean, you know, you know, there are a lot of weird people in the world. Have you ever been in a weird situation where you you met some guy who was just trying to impress his girlfriend by just trying to be like kind of pushy around you? And, and how do you handle that if that happens? I haven't been in that situation. I have been in that situation actually. I mean, just just move on. Yeah, I'll say. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's a terrific yeah. film. Come and yeah, see it. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. 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 Thank you.